Philippine team head coach Yang Giao said Korea is not just about Ricardo Ratliff. Ratliff, a former PBA import, is now playing as a naturalized player for the reigning Asian Games champions. But he's not only the one delivering the goods for the Koreans. Indeed, he's not just one of Korea's shooters as shown in the team's 11777 thumping of Thailand that enabled the Koreans to complete a three game sweep of their group preliminaries. Six players on the Korean team scored in double figures with the six foot eight Ratliff finishing with 21 points. Although Ratliff averages 23 points and 13 rebounds per game, Giao said they have to put on a solid defensive scheme if they are to be successful. We just have to prepare hard, said Giao noting the Koreans move so well and remarkably shoot from afar. Korea is getting balanced contributions, Giao added. The rain or shine led flipping team and Korea square off in a knockout quarterfinal on Monday. Size, according to Giao, won't be much of a problem. The best thing about Korea is they've been so patient running their plays. They rely on their ball movement and would wait for an opportunity to break down the defense and attack it, Giao said. In all the three games they played in the group stage matches, Korea didn't shoot below 40% from the rainbow territory. Its best shooting performance was against Thailand, where they hit 47% from the three-point zone, 15 of 32. One of Korea's snipers is Jian Junbyum. Turning 27 in a few days, Jian has been playing great with his three-point shooting, hitting five of eight from beyond the arc in their blowout victory over Thailand on his way to finishing with 20 points. He also had a solid showing against Mongolia, where he knocked down four of six trays to end up with 16 markers. Hyoung, a promising six-foot one guard, is also a newcomer in the team but showed a lot of potential following his decent shooting in the first three games. He averaged 12 points per game, including a perfect three-for-three three shooting from beyond the arc against Thailand. Hyo Ilyung and Lee Jungyun, two of the holdovers from the squad that won gold four years ago, remain to be solid contributors. The 6 foot 5 Hyo had his best game against in his team's 108 73 beatdown of Mongolia, where he finished with 20 points on 6 of 9 shooting from behind the arc. He also had 11 markers in their debut win against host Indonesia. Overall, Hio averaged 13 points per game. Lee is also a solid contributor. The 6 foot 3 forward averaged 11.6 points per game.